Let me actually take a look at this. Um, Whimsicott, I actually think in any situation that you're going to be using Whimsicott, you should always cut Taunt. My, this is my personal opinion for Encore. Because what are you doing? What are you taunting? Are you taunting Spore? Are you taunting Trick Room? Are you taunting um, Swords Dance? Like, what, what are you taunting, right? Uh, a lot of the times, you can just protect, let them do that thing, and then Encore them into it. Because if it's Swords Dance, if it's Trick Room, it's Tailwind, they're going to be left with their teammate fighting a 1v2 in that situation. So it's usually always better, I think, in the higher level to have Encore over Taunt, especially in a board that doesn't really have, like, an entity or something like that. So I, I really do like the uh, Encore over the Taunt if you have that option. I think Moltres looks okay. Incense a Roar set. You don't see that one as often. Kind of sick. Uh, Citrus Torkoal. All right. And Venusaur with Chlorophyll Vest. Now, that's not as good in this format because there's no G-Max, but let's see if we can make this work. I have, I have, I think we can do it. I think we got shots. Yo, a ho o team. Mewtwo, I'm, I'm doing it. We clicking it. Mewtwo's up. So we know they're going to be wanting to go in Sin because it's great here. So we're actually going to try our best to get our uh, our Moltres going. And then we're just basically just going to switch out Mewtwo for something that helps like the rest of our team do well. Probably our Incineroar. Um, and then just regain some board pressure. <sighs> see, I don't know how I feel about... I don't know. See, like, Venusaur and Whims get kind of grinded on here. I don't know how I feel about Torkoal. Setting the sun would be hard. I think you have to go like Venu. Let me actually think about this. Hold on. And we have to just go Venusaur here. I'm not a fan of this Pokemon in this situation, but it's okay. Let's go. Wouldn't believe how salty people can be on Showdown when you use Shuckle Chansey. I mean, that's usually what happens. Yeah, I'm so glad we're not playing the ho Omir. -Oh I'd much rather use a Mewtwo to do it. <laughs> Yeah, so right now we're going to be fishing for those Adrenaline Orb procs by baiting them into going in Sin. Judging by the fact that we're using a Mewtwo, like Mewtwo Venusaur, right at the top of our board. Really, really good that you organize your team previous this way. It tunnels people into saying, like, wow, Incin's so good here. Which, Incin is a good Pokemon here. Um, so, like, we'll see what they want to get done. Let's see. I am afraid of that Mamo. I wonder if it's going to be Sash on the Mamo. That's the biggest thing. Is it Sash or Vested? Right? Which one is it? I guess it could be Banded too, but like Sash or Vest are the pretty common items on Mamoswine. And it feels so good. Like, this guy shouldn't know this is me. I'm on my alt account. Right? He shouldn't know. Uh oh, Mamo. Awesome. That's that's great for them. That's great for me. I can just side strike the shit out of something. I, I thoroughly enjoy this. Uh, I think it's probably better to go after Mamo, to be completely fair. You guys think it's Sash Mammo or not? What do you guys think? Where would the Sash be if it wasn't on the Mammo? It has to be on the Mammo. We're gonna do it like this for one turn. If it doesn't go the way I want, that sucks. We don't want to lose the Mewtwo, and Moltres should be slower than this Mammo, so we don't want to, like. Yeah, Sacred Fire is totally fine. We're blocking all this. We don't want we don't want our Mewtwo to die. Whenever you're playing Mewtwo, you definitely have to play yourself a little bit more close knit. You have to really, really, you know, Iso Crash. It's, it's fine. It's totally fine. We're losing Moltres here. I I don't think that matters at all. Even if we lose it, like it really doesn't matter. We just need to break Sash on that Mammo. Moltres isn't needed for anything particular, but you can't just throw away your Mewtwo like that. So like right, right now, we can come within Sin. We can fake out the. Uh, uh, ho -oh, seal that slot up, KO the Mammo, and just be in a great spot. And I actually think we're going to Aura Sphere the Mammo. I, I don't know if it's Vested. It doesn't look like it's Vested, judging by how much damage Ho-Oh did. It looks like it's probably the Sash set. And if they want to go, like, switch in there and send here, they're going to switch in on an Aura Sphere, which is going to be really, really good. So Aura Sphere should be able to KO here. And we're just going to go for a Fake Out. So again, we're conditioning our opponents into doing everything that we want. Protect Ho-Oh. Hey, cool. I'm, I have absolutely no problem. Like, I'm going to side strike that thing eventually, right? There's a Protect. Hey, that's totally fine. Great play. I think we're probably just going to Protect Mewtwo again and just Fire Blitz the Mammoth. Because well, that's the one Pokemon we have to get off the board, I think. Bandit or Orb? It's not Orb. We saw that. It's Sashed. Actually, should we just nuke this Ho-Oh? I wonder how much damage side strike does to this Ho-Oh. Just try it. Maybe they'll switch the Mammal out. Because they know we can kill it. 
How go? It goes great. It goes great. We got the Master Ball. He won a lot of games. I want to see how much damage you do to this Ho-Oh. I'm actually just curious to see how much damage like a Life Orb Mewtwo does. We should be able to actually get it off the board this turn. And then we have good Mons in the back. Ho-Oh is intimidated. Maybe it switches out. I, if Ho-Oh switches out for Sin, that's like absolutely nuts here. That's like a nuts play. Yeah, Mamoswine's gonna go for the double protect. Bro, not in my house. They know so those two those like two turns of tunneling in on that Mamo made the game go exactly the way we wanted to. It would have been really good to get that KO there. Um this Ho-Oh is it minus one though. So it's not gonna be able to KO. Probably get the burn. Oh no burn, we take those. Ho-oh down. Wolf destroyed you on his stream, that was rough. Uh I wouldn't say it was a destroy. You got down to his last two mons and we played like a 10 turn game. I would think that calling that a destroy would be um, not correct. I think that would be not correct. I would say it was just a just a pretty solid win. All right, there's the Incin. Yeah, very classy, right? Yeah, I agree, pretty classy. All right, so we're just gonna protect our Mewtwo and uh, switch out the Incin. Let me actually think about this. I think I might actually just Floy Blitz some ammo. Like, I don't really care. Yeah, we played like 10 turns. <laughs> we actually, that game against Wolf, um, a burn happened, a paralyze happened, a freeze happened, and sleep happened. Every single status went off in that game. So, a game the last like 10 turns where every single status moment happens. Yeah. How dare, how dare I lose a game, you know? How, how dare I lose a game? Yeah, he just played as, as good as we're champ. I tried to do a read and he didn't. Yeah, that's what a game came down to. We should be able to take this guy out. Mammo down for the count, awesome. So now that Mammo's down, like I should be able to use my Sin like a lot easier. So I'm probably switching out Mewtwo this turn though, we'll see. If I had Party Shot here, I'd switch out Mewtwo and Party Shot, for sure. Serena, see, this is why we wanted to really preserve. Uh, we want to get the man off the board so we can use Mons, like, Incineroar now to deal with that Serena. Uh, we can actually just attack this Serena, I think. I don't, I don't mind switching in here, just to alleviate pressure for, like, one turn. And just going for a Floor Blitz. Surprised I didn't switch in Serena that one turn that I went for a Fake Out. Power Whip. Yo, not today. Not in my house. Venusaur with the fourth resist. We take these. It doesn't matter if you want to Foy Blitz me. You'll take a ton of recoil. No, we outspeed them, so the reason a pretty decent and sin spread. Yo, almost one shot. Can we get a burn? Oh, the burn! <laughs> Yo, the big burn! Oh, I take those, man. Don't even act like I don't take those. I definitely do. Oh, that's so sick. The most value burn I've ever seen in my life. Wins up. Sometimes lucky. Yeah, you know it. You know what I'm about. And at this point, I'm just going to keep the Mewtwo tapped off. Just go for damage here. They're probably just going to scoop. We got it. Mewtwo wins up. Mewtwo better than Ho-Oh confirmed. Let's go. Eternatus with a Purloin. I wonder what that does. Prankster copycat? Uh, that's not how that works in this format, though. You know? Like, you would have to use Max Guard to make the like that whole thing work. There's something weird happening here. We're just gonna use Mewtwo. I'm gonna taunt something. Something's getting taunted. Wimscott ain't got time for this shit. I'm coming up with those big taunts. And Mewtwo can hit the uh, Shininja as well with Fire Blast. We're gonna get to burn it. We're gonna burn it with Fire Blast Mewtwo. Let's go. Let's go. Survey says. Do it. There it is. Uh, we can KO any of these. Is it gonna like ally switch me or something? Do I just want to kill it? It has Fake Out. Like we know that it has Fake Out. And then it gets Encore, right? You're scared, hold your hand. I know, right? It's scary. It is scary. 
I'm respecting it. So we res there's a sash somewhere too. Sash is somewhere. Probably gonna fake out the Mewtwo this turn though. Yep. Fake out Wimps. Wow. Awesome. Bolt switch. Go for it. Yeah, I wasn't I wasn't soaking that damage. This is absolutely fine. Cool. Oh, a crit, never lucky. Nasty Pop a Tom Pass? And maybe, but why wouldn't you just use a Lifebird? You know? Why wouldn't you just use Lifebird? Like, why is it a Purloin? Shedinja. Awesome. That works. I'm gonna taunt that thing. Am I gonna taunt it? Yeah, we're just trying to hit the Shinja around. That's the Sash. If that's gonna tell you the best best of one strat I lost to, go for it. That's all you. Go for it. Sub. Go for it. Yeah, I don't think that there's a problem here. It's probably Eevee Light then. And it's probably Sash from the Shed. So that means it's probably Magnet or Specs on Lucky. This would be Sash right here. And that's totally fine. Eliminator, rain with the party at seven. Thank you. Yo, Torkoal doesn't care about shit. Torkoal, big busted right now. now. Let's go. Thank you so much for the raid. Hope you had a great stream. Appreciate it. Simple beam surf fetch, causing power each made a psych up so bro with the body press. That's cool. That's cool. Surfetch gets Simple Beam? Yo, I should use that in my Mewtwo team. That's actually really funny. I think Latios is a great Simple Beam user. Yeah, let's see. Uh, Torkoal's amazing here. Torkoal is sitting on this board, ready to just pop people in the mouth. Pinned by your boy. Yeah, they know. They know they're going down for the count. They're like, ha, I will break Sash. I actually did a lot of damage. Encore, go for it. Uncle mean a weather ball? That's fine. Nice uncle, bro. Hopefully I can still break sub. You the encore was there, so it's sub encore fake out. Again, professional player, that's plus one. Not falling for encore shenanigans. That shouldn't have went into that slot. That's dumb. Oh well. Hopefully Toro can hit. Awesome. Single target. We take things. They can get those subs up forever. I think I'm just in a good spot. Um They're probably gonna encore my uh what is it? They're probably going to Encore my Torkoal this turn. And start, like, Cosmic Powering. Yeah, that's probably the right play. I have Mewtwo in the back. I got Horses in the back. I think I'm okay to just come on Mewtwo eventually and just win the game. We're stuck here. We have to Weather Ball. Do we? We don't. Yeah, I think I'm fine using Yon here. I think Yon's a good play here. Just just because it, it sets up what we want to do. You can sub. You can do whatever you want. You can Encore my Torkoal. I'll Heat Wave your Pearl Wind. That's fine. Sub. Go for it. So let's see what they're doing here. Show me a Dynamax Cannon. Dynamax Cannon. Ha! Ha! Fairy type. Fairy type. All right. So he's going to go big night. Good night. Good fight. This person trying to cheese me with this pearl one, and I'm like not having it, you know? <laughs> That's right, you're switching. That is correct. Bring back out Lucky. Yeah, this is going good for me. And then next turn, I'm going to be able to do... Um, we haven't seen the last move, and I think the last move is Ally Switch. I'd like to see the last move, you know? Yeah. Because I don't want my Mewtwo to take the damage from that Lucky, you know? If it's Ally Switch, it's Ally Switch. And let's see. Shit, Ninja's down. It's not Ally Switch. Right? 
I was so sure what happened already. Let's go! Side strike! Please, please yeet. Bro, you're too big busted. So, what move is he doing over there? Is it foul play or some shit? Icy win? Foul play, cool. Foul play's a good move. Awesome. No, ally switch. I don't, don't got to respect that shit at all. Do I? Mewtwo should outspeed the other thing. I think I'm just going to go with... They're, they're going to encore my whims, right? Let me actually think about this. I'm going to taunt that Eternatus. I don't want it to get a single causing power up. And I'm, I'm faster than Pearl Wind is, so I can go for this taunt. So I can, I can stick this before it does anything weird. Um, if, they, if they want to go, like, protect and foul play my Torkoal, like, that's fine. Yep, and that's that's totally fine. Tailwind up. Tailwind's fine. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't... Tailwind... Tailwind doesn't matter at all. We're outspeeding them anyways, right? There's the Encore into the Wimp slot, right? Yeah, so... It was encoring that slot instead of encoring the uh, the other one, and so like I'm completely fine to just do this exact same thing. I will I will taunt your your bro over there, and uh, let's see. I'm gonna heat wave. I'm gonna get the pro one off the board. I if if I, if I gets one cosmic power up, this thing's gonna get out of range. It'll be able to like trade really really effectively with the rest of my board, and if I taunt it, it also can't protect. So, like, I still want this taunt. We don't even know if the Eternatus can even hit our whims. So, like, I want to taunt it. If you're in Dynamax Cannon or Torkoal, I don't know if we die. Yep, sub is fine. Dynamax Cannon into the Torkoal slot. So, we're going to be able to bring out the Venusaur and they can't protect. Never lucky Torkoal. I'm so sorry, buddy. Orb! Awesome. Alright, so I think we just made the Mewtwo. Let me just check this Mewtwo. Are we full speed? We are. Oh, yeah. We, we, we big. We big. So we're going to switch out the Wimps for Venusaur. Take out the uh, the E-turn. And we're going to leave the uh, Viper with the All My Friends Are Dead Syndrome. We're risking the speed tie a little bit here. But I think we're gonna be fine. They have to be full speed as well. Pearl Wind actually did a lot. It did a lot. I just played around it really well. If if he would have got even one like really good encore, we, we would have lost. You know, we didn't let ourselves get encore baited. Yeah, and you could totally foul play KO the Mewtwo, but then we just send out Whims and we have Whims Venusaur win the game. Mewtwo's up. That's right. Mewtwo is up. So you can totally KO right here. It's weird to see Pearl Wind though. But again, I didn't, let, I didn't let anything weird happen. Wimscott's going to be fine. Venusaur's going to be fine. Let's go. But yeah, sub, fake out, foul play, encore. Cool set. Encore's not going to get your way out of this one, buddy. And then we got it. Battle was canceled. Shedinja Pearl One guy ain't got nothing. Nothing. Maractus. You face Maractus. Yo, Belden gifted five subs. Oh my goodness. Five big gifted subs for September. Yo, thank you. Holy moly, guys, put some subs up. Put some subs up. Yo, that's their 18th gifted sub in the channel. I appreciate the generosity, my friend. Yo, keeping the lights on for another day. Appreciate it. Thank you. What do we want to do here? Um, Maractus gets after you. I have to respect that. Uh, we don't have any terrain control. I think we can just go like Whims, though. I think Whims is still good. I think like Whims Mewtwo seems okay. Like, what do we do if they go Whims Mewtwo? We just lose? If they go Trick Room and we lose? Yeah, that's uh, that's how you lose. Uh, I guess we have Torkoal to come in from there. I don't really like this at all. I think I'm going to go Moltres, actually. I think Moltres is still okay because it forces the Groudon to split what it wants to do. I think these two cover most of my options. I think we're still going to bring the Torkoal. 
I think we still should bring Mewtwo. I think Moltres is going to be sick here. Rakdos, best Corpho Mon changed my mind. I mean, I don't know about that one. But, yo, that'll do. Thank you so much for those gifted subs. That's freaking the best thing I've ever seen in my life. Look how happy I am. I'm so excited. Yeah, I respect Rakdos, too. It's probably going to be the Sashmon, right? It's probably going to be the Sashmon over there. All right. Let's see. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is fine. Watch me Storm Drain. It might be. They gave Mewtwo Psychic Terrain. Bro, imagine if Mewtwo was the Psychic Terrain setter. <laughs> Bro, that would be nutty. That would be so nutty. All right, I'm going to Nasty Plot. Let me actually check this Moltres Eevee spread. Like, what are we What are we actually using? Are we like a full speed Moltres? Ah, we have just enough speed. All right. I'm going to Nasty Plot, though. These moves are, like, all bad. Grass Knot won't KO the... Actually, I think I would as Wrath instead of the Nasty Plot. Because we don't want to speed that Entei. I think I'm going to Wrath and Grass Knot, and I'm going to hope that they're bad. No. I'll Wrath and Earth Power. I want the Entei off the board. Protect Groudon. Bro! <laughs> Let's go! I do not care if you lose this Venusaur. I'm, I'm getting so much damage on your Entei right now. It's like crazy. Boy, let's go for, oh my gosh, he just like murdered himself. I, I think it's Scarf Entei. That's why I went for it. I was like, one of these things can protect and one cannot. Getting that Entei off the board is straight busted. That's huge, getting that Entei off the board. All right, that's good. That's really, really good. Trade one for one? Like, we did not need Venusaur. I know he was like, oh man, I needed to do this. I, but this is fine. I really like that the Moltres Mewtwo, like, it's spreading, it's making so the ground on, one, it basically has to heat crash for the next couple turns. Oh, that's a good, that's good too for us. I think we're actually just going to do the same thing. Like, just Fiery Wrath uh, or Spear. Hopefully it's not Shuka, or hopefully it's not Chopple, but it might be Sash, so that's why we're going to double. I don't know if Groudon can one-shot Mewtwo. I don't think we we can't one-shot the Groudon. So that's that's gonna be true right there. I think they probably they're not switching. Alright. Let's hope we can take out the Staka. That's great. I take those. Chopple's fine with the nerve. Oh shit, you're right, we're unnerved. Yo, Mewtwo busted. Unnerved. Never heard of it. I, I completely forgot. Uh, it's good. It's because a lot of my Mewtwo's are always pressure because I don't have the ability patches to use. Can we get a flinch? No. But the thing is, P Blades shouldn't kill our Mewtwo here. Unless they're orb. What did they miss? I take those. I guess we just won. Because we're faster there too. This is this game's over. Double protect into like Psy Shock Fire Wrath. Get the game. Yeah. I forgot we were on nerf. Mewtwo big busted. Vince there. I've been so much there crafting a mon to struggle out with is Serena. First impression Haxorus. Don't uh, first impression's not good. Don't do it. Don't that sounds weird. I wouldn't do that. That sounds really weird. But that sounds cool. It sounds like a little bit too gimmicky though. But really funny. Alright, so let's see if they're a setting of like SD. Like if they SD with this real this turn, like, oh my gosh, that'd be bad. Big knockoff. No fake out either. Hmm. That's weird. I actually think I'm going to ignore... Who do we ignore here? Because if we go up to the ground and lose our Mewtwo for it, we'll lose the game. So I actually think it's like better to Fire Wrath and just side Strike this Rilla because it shouldn't be able to protect and side Strike would go through a Vest. So I think it's probably the right play to just nuke the Rilla. Yeah, Grass Guide's the right play. If it crits us, we're bad. Nah, that's not going to do enough. This is fine. Big damage. Side Strike! Ooh, hopefully we can get the KO with uh, Moltres here. Moltres! Let's go! Oh, that big vested Rilla. Yeah, that sucks. It's damage on Moltres. I, mean, I guess Mewtwo didn't die, but like still very not great for us. I guess we got a Berserk prop. We take those. Alright, so they're going to Grassy Glide our Mewtwo. So I, I think that has to be vested Rilla. So we're just going to go with a Fiery Wrath and uh, Protect, and then we'll be good next turn. 
We got it! That P-Blade's miss definitely cost him the whole game. I don't think that real has protect. I think it has to be vested. It's shown, it's shown that it's vested. Shiny Mindfu! Yo, that's sick! Use the ability patch instead of capsule. Oh no. Wait, 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 what do you mean he's ruined? Wait, you just, you have regenerator? Regenerator is really good in singles. Just use it for singles. Yeah, regenerator is a great ability. Bro, Moltres is straight crazy out here. Getting those big crits? Moltres out here taking names. Undefeated with Mewtwo. Oh, it's Reckless? Mm, that's not good. But you know what is good? Undefeated streak with Mewtwo. I do be taken. It did better than I thought. I'm not going to lie. I think this team did better than I thought. I think your Venusaur would be better if it was a Specs Venusaur. Because Specs Venusaur actually gets a lot of damage. I would cut the grass not for Leaf Storm, my personal opinion. But that set with a Specs gets a lot of value. Um, I think Torkoal was great. Uh, I don't think you need Roar with Sin. I think you have enough Mons to where like Zern's not that big of a deal. So I would definitely put Parting Shot on there over Roar, my personal opinion. And uh, against the Whims, I would cut the Taunt for Encore. Other than that, the team is great. I like the way it worked. A lot better than I thought. Uh, we didn't find any ogre teams, um, but like, still pretty good squad.